Understanding Lease Disagreements, a guide for English language learners. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're diving into a practical and very relevant topic, lease disagreements. Whether you're renting an apartment, a house, or even office space, understanding the ins and outs of lease agreements and the potential for disagreements is crucial. Let's explore what lease disagreement means and how you can navigate these situations effectively. Before we delve into disagreements, it's important to understand what a lease is. A lease is a legal contract between two parties, the landlord, the owner of the property, and the tenant, the person renting the property. This contract outlines the terms and conditions of renting the property, including rent amount, payment schedule, duration of the lease, and rules regarding the use of the property. A lease disagreement arises when the landlord and tenant have conflicting views or interpretations regarding any aspect of the lease agreement. These disagreements can range from rent payment issues, maintenance responsibilities, to rules about subletting or pet policies. Recognizing and addressing these disagreements early on is key to preventing more serious conflicts. Rent increases. Disagreement over when and how the landlord can increase the rent. Repairs and maintenance. Confusion over who is responsible for certain repairs and upkeep of the property. Security deposits. Disputes about the return of the security deposit at the end of the lease term. Lease termination. Disagreements regarding the conditions under which the lease can be terminated early by either party. 1. Review your lease agreement. Always start by reviewing the terms of your lease. Many disagreements can be resolved by understanding the written terms. 2. Communicate clearly. Reach out to the other party to discuss the issue. Clear communication can often resolve misunderstandings. 3. Seek mediation. If direct communication doesn't resolve the issue, consider mediation. A neutral third party can help facilitate a solution. 4. Legal advice. In cases where an agreement cannot be reached, seeking legal advice may be necessary to understand your rights and obligations. Lease disagreements can be challenging, but they are often solvable with clear communication and a solid understanding of your lease agreement. Remember, knowing your rights and responsibilities is the first step towards resolving any disagreement amicably. We hope this video has shed some light on lease disagreements and how to approach them. Thank you for watching, and see you in our next video.